Stand by. Between everybody, just like going to school, trying to better myself. All those stuff we wrap are packed with delicious ingredients. That pump will kill you. Competition day. YouTube, it's your boy JB Shoes back with another one. You heard that right. You read that title right. I am finally shooting my first competition this morning saturday april the 13th Woo, what can i say what can i say a little nervous but good nerves i'm excited but i really don't know what to expect <coughs> no free advertisement but whatever i need this this morning Go ahead and drop in the comments how bad these are for you. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Anyway, first competition, man. I think this is uh, going to be an IDPA format. Um, so I called the guy that uh, that's hosting it a few days ago to kind of find out what to expect, you know. He said there's so many rules about it. He can talk on on it all day. So he would explain to me um, 30 minutes before the match. So I think it's gonna be pretty relaxed. Um, my goal is just not to get DQ, man. I just want to finish the day with the score. So yeah, um, we are heading that way now, and um, I'll check back in with you. Hey, so we here you see a stage set up behind me i'm gonna go ahead and get uh registered get checked in all that good stuff um man the nerves are really starting to settle in a little bit but uh man it's gonna be all right it's gonna be a good day it's a beautiful day outside so we're gonna go ahead and get registered uh get signed up pay the pay the fee and um i check back again all right so we all signed up registered all that good stuff we are in the carry optics division and they gave me a rundown of everything but basically um allowed three mags 10 rounds in your two spares and 11 in the gun so uh this is one of the stages um looks pretty fun interesting um so yeah i'm about to uh i guess have a little shooters meet and go over all the rules and all that and uh, get the popping off. So uh, stay tuned. Scott Wendy, just we were roofing. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I say I heard of him. I knew it. I did. Are you ready? Yes. Stand by. Of course, I'm sure you know Jeff Doty. Yeah. You have a. Mate ready. Uh, 
I didn't get one on that first day. Hey, I'm by. I'm by. So three stages down, three more to go. Have no idea where I'm placed at. I've got a couple PEs. Come on now, dog. Come <laughs> on, man. Um, but uh, it's really just a shooting order that's kind of messed me up. I'm kind of new to all that, but uh, moving on to stage number four. Hey, it's hot. Slow, wait, ready. And bye. You got your name on your pistol, you got your name on all your behaves. Well. Stand up, unload, show clear. Alright, so this is the last stage. Only one down here. Did pretty good, man. I'm proud of myself. Yes, sir. Alright. So that's it. First competition is under my belt. Uh, where do I start? It was about uh, 10 shooters out there. And um, I don't know exactly where I placed. Hopefully I didn't come dead last. But if I did, hey, it is what it is. Gotta start somewhere. They were all older guys, but they do come out there pretty often. You can tell that they, they shoot a good bit. And um, just to be out there with them and kind of get that first competition out of the way, see where I'm at, get a good baseline to where I need to work on and um, improve from there. And I'm just gonna get better, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get better and we gonna, we gonna rock this thing on out. All right, at the cribbo, a little later on in the day, had to wait on those results to get in to kind of try to close this video out. Um, we are clear, empty. Man, I will say, man, I love this gun, love how it performed, but I, on the other hand, didn't do so great. Um, out of 10 shooters, I placed nine. <laughs> um, but uh, not trying to make excuses, but it was my first time, first time in that type of environment, shooting around that many people, uh, you know, no redos none of that uh so you know we got a brief uh, rundown quick walkthrough of the stages and it was time to go and um i did run every stage last they let me do that try to kind of uh, watch everybody um see how they ran the stage and i'm not gonna say that didn't help but um i got so many different ideas i kind of kind of confused myself a little bit and then when it was my time to go i was like my mind went blank and it uh it helped me but it kind of hurt me at the same time because i kind of overthought things and forgot other things um so my biggest takeaway is uh shooting order um i, I know that hurt me a good bit um when to reload so i can have enough uh ammo to um engage targets so i know on uh I believe it was maybe the third stage there was a, a swinger and I'll pop it up if I can find it um, um, there was a swinger target behind a barrel where I didn't reload in time or fast enough early enough in the stage to be able to engage 
uh, the second swinger. There's two swingers behind the barrel. So I know I got um, a no shoot, or not a no shoot, but uh, I got time added for not engaging that target. So the biggest thing was uh, not necessarily the shooting part, but when to shoot, what not to shoot, when to reload, um, where to shoot from, how many targets I got to engage, all of that. So uh, that just comes with experience. And I have a little bit of experience under my belt now. Um, try to show you some of the, the stats here. So as you can see, it was 10 and I came in night. And uh, let me see. My raw time, which what I'm looking at is my raw time was 97.31. If you look at first place, he had a 94.60 with zero penalties, zero mistakes. Um, he didn't have all A zone hits or um, zero hits in IDPA. Um, and uh, it resulted in a first place win for him overall. So that was, that's what I'm looking at, man. Um, I could probably stand to slow down a little bit to get all my hits and um, make sure I don't make those mistakes like that. So I, out of everybody, I, I was the only person in double digits with mistakes. So mistakes will kill you. And um, like I said, this, the shooting part was fun. It wasn't, I didn't find it overly difficult to where I was like, I felt like I was out of my, my realm completely. But um, <clears throat> just gotta slow down and make sure I tighten up on those mistakes and we'll be a little bit higher up on that leaderboard. But um, if you made it this far in the video, I appreciate you from the bottom of my heart. We are almost at 3,000 subs. The channel is almost monetized. And um, <clears throat> got a lot more coming down the road, man. A lot more. Um, definitely going to focus more on competition. And um, we will sprinkle in some reviews and stuff in when I, whenever I get new stuff. Um, and some more EDC work. But I really uh, understand what I have to incorporate in my training now, which is movement, more targets less static build drill bull crap for the internet um really focus on trying to become a better shooter um <clears throat> and overall because there's more aspects to shooting than just you know standing in one place letting you rip on a steel target so uh real eye opening and uh man it's fun though ton of fun ton of fun everybody was nice informative try to help me as much as possible um but yeah um, next one is next uh, month, the first Saturday, first and second Saturday. So I'm going to try to make it out there and make another video for you guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you made it this far, drop two flames in the comment section for me. Let me know that you're watching it all the way through. Make sure y'all like, share, and subscribe. Um, and y'all stay dangerous. See y'all in the next one. Peace.